Alright, what we're doing here today is we're making a red drum fishing rig used for catching red drum on long surf casting reel, rod and reels on piers and beaches, jetties, whatever. First, you're going to need some 100 pound test. That's for the, uh, you know, so the fish does not pull your tackle. Next, you're going to need a 7 to 10 knot circle hook with, I use the tournament grade owner circle hooks with the bent eyelet. Then, you're going to need to take, take about a foot and a half of the 100 pound test, run it through the eyelet a good ways, double it back, and then pull make the make the circle pretty big and then um you're gonna overlap it about about six times three four five, six six times and then pull it pull the circle tight pull it while pulling the other end there there's your knot I think it's called an overhand loop knot you can look it up on the internet if you can't understand how to do it when I show you Next, you're going to take a hundred, I prefer, 150 pound test, uh, Bill Fisher crane swivel. You're gonna, and then you're going to take a hundred pound test, uh, double barrel crimping sleeve. Slide that on the hundred pound test on the other end. Then you're going to put crane swivel. I prefer to cut it as sh very short to the hook for maximum casting distance. Um, let's see. And then double it back through the other hole of the crimp. Pull tight. And then what you're going to need, you're going to need some Bill Fisher crimps, the crimper. Then you need to put it in there. Crimp it down. There you go. That simple. And cut that there again. What I like to do is I like to neaten it up so it gets tighter also. There you go. There's your drum fishing rig. Well, that's it.